As someone doing accounts receivable inside of Business Central, we need to provide supporting documentation around journal entries or uh, documents we've processed. One way we can do that in Business Central is in the fact box, which is available on most cards and documents. You can attach files, add links, and write notes. Today we're going to look at notes in BC, attachments in BC, printing as a PDF and saving in BC, and links to web pages. Let's get started. So we're looking at sales orders. And on the right hand side, I will open up the fact box. So on the fact box, I will see that there is this attachments um, option. This tells me how many attachments are actually already attached. So in this case, I have no attachments attached. I can also add notes um, onto a document. So by clicking the plus button, I can add a new note for, the, for as an example. So I'm on a sales order a document here and I can add a note. Please review this document as an example. Hit OK. Now this note is now assigned with a time stamp as to, or date stamp as to when it was created and the user who created it. You can also click on here and edit that note or delete the note if I needed to. If I go back to details, once again, I see the normal fact box um, information. Let's now look at the attachment feature. So I can go to attachments in the fact box, select the uh, button to attach, and I can now select or, or attach a file. So the, an example of this may be a journal entry I'm doing. I can attach an Excel spreadsheet as supporting documentation or a PDF document um, as attachment to the original sales order, do a bunch of different things. Um, so we can select a file on our PC, we can preview it, um, it'll show us the file type data it was attached, the user attached it. Something else we can do is I can actually um, print off a or attach a PDF of the sales document. So where this would be useful would be uh, or an example of this would be um, is when document flows in multiple steps, such as in the sales process, I can refer to the previous um, document in that process as, as a supporting document. So a quote, you can print a quote and attach it to an order or an order attached to an invoice that would be an example of that. So we have an order here and I'll go to a print and send, we'll attach as a PDF. It'll ask me which document I want. I'll just do an order confirmation form. I'll hit OK. It's now generating the PDF. And you see it, there's a one attachment. If I was to drill into that, I have a sales confirmation document that's attached as a PDF. And we can preview this. And here's our sales um, confirmation, order confirmation that uh, printed out. On the vendor and customer cards, I can also um, attach links. So the, where this could be useful would be, um, I could have the vendor's um, website as a link here where I do place orders as an example. Uh, so to add a link, once again, I just hit in the plus button, I put in the link address with the, with a description, which I've done in this case. If I was to click on that, it would bring me to the web page. To get started with the attachment and link and notes capability within Business Central, please contact Profit Business Group by visiting our webpage at www.profit.ca. Thank you.